Good to you all. The lesson that I'll be doing for you all today is the interview written by Christopher Sylvester. Interview is a fine form of journalism, and it has evolved so much over a period of time that it has taken to the proportion of a fine art form. It is an art as the interviewer has to learn what to ask and how to ask from an interviewee. As then only he might be able to make the interviewee share things and informations, instances and incidents that his viewers or the readers and the audiences would love to hear and listen to, and to generate a sense of curiosity and ex excitement among his followers and fans. Sometimes the journalists make the life of the celebrities look bigger and greater than they actually are in their real life. and which is why most often the not they the celebrities prefer to look other way around rather than having to react to what has simply been spoken or written about for as they prefer their work should speak for them rather than this themselves have to do all the talking about all the time around either to defend or to live up to expectations of what has been spoken or written about for some people find that the interviews are nothing but intrusion in their private spaces and which is why they simply prefer to shy away from successful people do have certain unique qualities and which make them achieve greater and bigger things in life which are generally the common people lack about in their own life and there these unique qualities can sometimes inspire and motivate the common people to turn around things in their own favor after having learned a thing or two from the lives of the celebrated celebrities Umberto Eco, a celebrated professor and an author, said that he preferred himself to an academician rather than a novelist. He being a symbolist and a well-known figure among the academic community. The reason for the success and the greater achievement for the successful people are their deep sense of dedication for their work and their sense of humility and their capacity to accept their own shortcomings and limitations. Sometimes the successful people successfully use their free spaces in their own advantage to such an extent that that help them achieve much greater and bigger things than the common people can even afford to think about for and which is what make all the difference in the lives of these celebrated celebrities please work out with the dictionary for the following words for their etymology usage and definition extravagant despise intrusion formidable interstice semiotics trash Have a this is seminal delve thank you